Good morning everyone, hope you're all okay. Um, I've been asked about my bottle caps. Somebody had watched uh, one of my other videos where I was flattening some bottle caps. <coughs> um, I get them from, well I've got them from eBay before but they're a bit expensive like that. So the, these ones, I won't puzzle them about, just the crown caps. I get them from store called Wilco Wilkinson's called it Wilk they call it Wilco now it used to be Wilkinson's and just metal crown caps and they're um, a pound for a bag of 50 oh I've not closed my blind sorry um, yeah so I've, I was just I'm just flattening some so I thought right I'll come on and because the lady wanted to know what I've done with them or something so, uh, well, I mean, I have shown these before, but I just made some little. Whether you can see, I use them. Um, well, these ones I've bought, I buy them off of little images off of, uh, not Pinterest. Uh, what do you call it? Etsy. You can get some free, but these ones. I bought off of Etsy, just one inch ones, just cut those out with your punch and then uh, some people use glossy accents <coughs> to put on the top of the bottle cap but I don't, on the top of the picture but I use these, oh I'm so sorry if you can't see these epoxy stickers, these ones I got from Aliexpress but they're, I actually don't think they're as good as the other ones that I've got from eBay. Well, they're, they're all right. They are, they are okay. But the ones from eBay were more expensive. But they're called epo epoxy stickers, epoxy domes. I don't know what else they're called. But that's, that's what I use. <coughs> um, so you know I've got quite a few little things that I've bought off of little chocolate ones <coughs> all sorts of images and then um, say there's those that I've made and then I've got all sorts <laughs> just ones with some that I've done as magnets magnets on the back, little butterflies, again the is that upside down, oh no. So they're the plain plainish ones. Just let me pop those. Oh there's not enough room to swing a cat oh dear, sorry if you got a sight of my bum then. I got the shorts on this morning. I'm hot this morning. Uh, what else have I done? These little bits, I've got a plain one, right. Shown these, these are what I was inspired by Scrimping Mummy. She's got a video of showing you how to do these, just fill it with, well I filled them with hot glue, I think Amanda did as well, hot glue first and then just press all your seed beads or whatever you want in. And then I put glossy a bit of glossy accents on the top. Well, it's not glossy accents; it's a cheap version, but it's oh God, I don't know where I've put it? Where have I put it? Oh, I haven't got a clue what I've done with it. I've got a spare one, I think. That's what I've sometimes used to put on the top. Or if you want the cheap version of glossy accents, that's from the range. It's called. Anita's clear gloss and it is just the same as glossy accents but a third of the price um yeah these are well I do all sorts of weird stuff <laughs> I have shown these before so apologies to anybody that's already seen them and then these are what I've been doing I just got a little uh, half circle of card that I got left over from something. 
and put a little half a doily on. Um, these were actually inspired by Janet Stokes sent me some and I haven't got any in here. Um, she'd done a little, uh, she'd sent me a round one and it was lovely but my round doilies were too big so I just cut them in half just layered it up. I really don't know whether you can see or not. Probably end up not uploading this if I play it back. Uh, yeah, so I'll say I've just been flattening some through my I'll just, I'll just do it again quickly if I can. Just in case there's anybody watching that hasn't seen oh, I don't know I'm gonna be able to do it now. Um I'm not telling anybody to do this, but this is just how I do them. Uh, yeah, I mean, you, if you do want to have a go, you might have to play about with, see which platform you want out, depending how, I mean, I, I just used my really old boards, I mean, they're right warped. So I just got one you can't even see but I've just got one of the tabs down and one back uh, where have I put them oh there we go do you know you can see or not sorry yeah. I'll just pop them it doesn't really matter which way I mean, they, they will stick in a little bit sometimes it doesn't really matter which way they go so you will have to probably play around and don't you I wouldn't suggest using bright your brand new boards but it works for me so and then just run it through stuck to there but they just come off and what I do is just usually put my nail under there or put, if you can't get it out with your nail put scissors or something under and that just peels out I mean I've, I've seen people getting it out with a hot a heat gun but that doesn't work for me I couldn't get on doing that I just found I mean all that doesn't come off but it doesn't matter, does it? Because you're just going to, you know, if you can't get your nail under, just shove scissors or something under. And then I just put some of that glue that I've just shown you, glossy accents I use, and then just stick your that on. Give it a good old press down. Obviously that won't stick because there's no glue on it. That's it. I can't think there's anything else I can show you that I've done. Um, but they're dead easy. I've only been able to find these bottle caps in the gold from Wilkinson's. I mean, there's obviously I've got some here, look, but some silver ones there without the plastic bits in but they they work out a lot more expensive I got those from I can't remember the name of the seller for, um, I think it was is it called House of Make something like that <coughs> excuse me on um, eBay but they were more expensive but I think this is great the, the ones from Wilkinson suit me fine so I hope that helps you uh, if there's anything else just give me a shout but I can't seem to find anything else that I've made but say so just that's about really do anything you want so thanks for watching and I shall speak to you soon have a good day bye